stop it, I don't want you here yeah. It's something about the way you said Hey y'all and welcome or welcome back to our channel. So today is Sunday. It's usually cleaning day But my kitchen looks ten times worse than it does on usual Sundays. So this is gonna be part two of The organization so today I'm going to organize the pantry So I'm going to show you guys what the pantry looks like I'm going to show you what the kitchen looks like currently um, The refrigerator I have to just restock it so it's still clean It's still got the organize the organization containers in there. It just needs to be restocked. So Right now, I'm going to show y'all what the pantry looks like. Y'all can kind of see it look so good. So, I organized the pantry like a couple months after we first moved here. But I've kind of neglected pretty much the whole entire thing. I stopped caring about just how it actually looked and I just started throwing stuff in there. Um, I bought the seasoning things like I showed y'all in the first vlog if y'all didn't watch that go back and watch that right now the link is gonna be above for you to go ahead and watch that then you come back and watch this video sis so this is what the pantry is looking like and then this is what the actual kitchen is looking like like it is tore down like I have grocery trash everywhere the organizing bins are still lined up over there so today we're gonna get that done we are going to get the whole kitchen clean to where the countertops are spotless period so without further ado i am going to take everything out of the pantry um then the drawer that i actually want the seasonings to go in is going to be by the stove so it's going to be this drawer right here i have to also clean this drawer out and then fill the seasonings that's probably going to be like the very last thing that i do because that is like a little bit time consuming because i do have a lot of actual seasonings i don't use the basic seasons i use everything so without further ado i am about to clean out the pantry take everything out lining against the cabinets and stuff like that and then um once i start doing actual seasoning then i'm gonna come back and explain that to y'all before i actually start doing that but everything is gonna be pretty much y'all just watching me do it so without further ado let's get right into it. So right now I'm going to clean the shelves with this clean freak and a towel. I'm going to show y'all what it looks like after I uh, took everything out. So this is how it's looking. I didn't get the top because I have to go find the step ladder. So I'm going to get that down in a second. But I'm pretty sure up there it's not dirty. So whatever. But like this stuff like syrups and stuff has spilled and all the other stuff. And stuff just got dusty and just nasty. So I'm about to like really scrub that and clean it. And then after that, I'm going to start placing the bins how I want them to be placed um, in, the, in the pantry. So I don't know. 
looking like I've organized pretty much everything um, the only thing I have to do is order some um, clip on labels to go here and then I'm gonna order some labels to go on these so that you'll know that this is powdered sugar this is flour this is regular sugar and this is pancake mix um, and then I also want labels for like the cereal and the snacks um, everything that I have as far as stuff that I didn't have a container for is up there. So this week I'm gonna try to go to um Home Goods to find some more containers to kind of put like the bottles and that stuff in. But for the most part, I might find like two of these to go up there. And then I might um transfer like my husband's bang drinks and stuff that the kids don't need to touch at the top. But um these are like the snacks. Um, teas, more snacks, and um, bag oatmeal. Then we love cup oatmeals because they are fast and you can just put them, put water in and put it in the microwave. I'm also going to go to Target because this is where I got these from, from Target. These are the large bins from Target. They're like $7. Um, I'm probably going to get two more, a gray and another white. One for bread and then one for stuff like overflow. So like if I refill like the sugar and stuff like that, then I can just put it in the bin right here. These are like chips and stuff like that, granolas. And these are like the big extra large bags of chips and stuff like that. Um, I decided to keep the um, this little spinners. And on this one I have like the tea, soy sauce, Heinz 57, spray cheese, lemon juice, vegetable oil. And on this I have like all of the condiments, so mayo, ketchup my chick-fil-a sauce uh ketchup back here i have like the ranch dressings and stuff like that another thing of mail because we like mail um and then here i have like all of my sauces like hot sauce um all of my sauce for my wings all of my um buffalo uh sauces my fiery sauce cajun sauce if y'all haven't tried this y'all need to try it if y'all don't like spending all of y'all money on fire crab, but I do. But sometimes when I get lazy, then I would just do this. Or if I'm out of coins, I'll just use this. And then we have hot sauce because my husband loves hot sauce on pretty much all of his food. And that is that. 
And then as far as the canned goods, I ordered this little tray from, I mean, yeah, this little tray thing from um, Amazon. I was going to order another one to extend right there, but since I decided to keep these, it won't actually fit. So as you can see, it wouldn't be able to fit. So I'm just going to keep it like this. And I pushed them forward so that um, back here, you can see I kind of have some space. If I have any of overflow of cans, so like back here I have like the... Uh, what is it the tunas i have those back here so that is that and this is how it's looking okay so i was currently editing this vlog to upload um but i forgot to update what the actual pantry looks like now so as you can see i kind of changed some stuff here i actually went and bought an extra bin from um home goods or whatever so i have like all of the can good not can goods have all of the snacks and back supply of whatever we didn't put in the containers up at the top um and stuff like that i still have this stuff right here because i absolutely don't know what to do with it as you can see i kind of changed the cereal were in these when i first started the vlog but now these are actual snack bins i still don't have the labels because i haven't found the ones that i actually wanted so i might just use my cricket machine and just print out what you call it to put on there but i'll just make a um a reel about that so make sure you guys are following me on instagram and also these are still the same so like i said i might just use my cricut to just what you call it but i just wanted to, just wanted to update you guys and show you guys what it looks like i still have the sauces here condiments here and all the other stuff here toppings and all the other stuff but what's different is I went to Ross one day and I found these actual um, cereal containers um, that are made for cereal. Um, I think the tag is still on the bottom. Yeah, these are like 12 something each. But these are the actual cereal ones. I think I got five. We love cereal. So, yeah, I have two. I line them up like this. I put one behind there. I might get one more if I, if I can find it. And I also bought the pasta ones. So, this is the pasta ones. I use one for the long pasta and one for these. Which I'm going to refill these after I use this little bit that's left. Um, I still haven't got a bread box. And I still have these same little things. But now we're down to one bin of um, oatmeal and one bin of bread. And then the rest is all just snacks. I This is okay, but they have these... Um, straw baskets that i'm thinking about changing these out to and and putting the bigger ones at the bottom to put the access of the drinks down here but like i said i'm gonna do a real probably with that um changing all of that stuff so this is what the pantry looks like so i want to thank you guys so much for watching this vlog so much for supporting make sure you comment like and subscribe to our channel and yeah this is our pantry and thank you guys so much for watching Sit back and roll all way, ayy. Spoken that shit to the face, ayy. I call it cool different race. Yes, she ain't on my car, hit the gate.